Warning: The following Let's Play series contains heavy themes such as graphic violence and sexual assault. This game is not recommended for anyone under the age of 16. If things like this disturb you, we ask that you please refrain from watching these videos. You have been warned. What's going on guys? Keto here and welcome to Wada no Hara and the Great Blue Sea. Now, um, for those who are familiar with this channel back when I was on my own, this was the very first Let's Play I ever recorded and uploaded to this channel. And um, looking back on it, the quality wasn't really the best. I wasn't impressed with um, how I did things back then. And now that I'm a better editor and, you know, better with... Um, Better with the software overall, I want to, you know, redo this series and do it in good, in better quality than, than than the way I did it before. So that is why that's why I'm doing this again, basically. So um, here we go. Of course, I knew. We felt the same way. I'm a fool. Why? Why couldn't I notice something within my own self? It's too late. Much too late for everything. And it's my fault. All of it. If only I had done better. I'm sorry. And yet... Now, I can't even tell you that. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's been a while since I've uh, done any real voice acting for, you know, Let's Play, so hopefully I'm not as rusty. Because um, back then I had no mic. I had, you know, it, it was just really bad. My first playthrough of this was really bad. So I just wanted to, you know, make a, a an improved version of my old Let's Play. You know, and things should be better now, given that I know how to use this recording software, and now that I have a mic, this uh, journey should be a little more easy to watch, basically. Nice to meet you. I am the Sea Witch. And you are? Hmm. Oh, is that right? Hmm. I've been waiting. Yes, I'm aware. Now, listen to this story I have to tell. As if swaying in the waves, lean back and listen. Hmm. Ah, yes. The moon is full tonight. I always make a wish every night of a full moon. Yes, I believe in such things. Oh, no, I'm just talking to myself. Never mind it. So yeah, like the pauses are basically, I, I guess like, it's us maybe talking to her or something like that. I don't quite remember. Lit by the moon, the seam seems to glitter just like the stars. Who knows what good can be found there? Right. Now then, shall we begin? This is the story of a witch. Whew, man, it's, it's been almost two years since I've even played this game, so... Oh, man. Yeah, this game was created by Deep Sea Prisoners. It really, um, for those who are 
brand new to this. This is a story-driven RPG Maker game created by uh, Deep Sea Prisoner. And um, they've also made games like Mogeko Castle and The Grey Garden, Garden Grey The, Obsolete Dream. It, yeah, a lot of different works, whether it's um, a web cartoon, web comic, a manga, or uh, games. Um, Deep Sea Prisoner works really hard on these. <clears throat> so enjoy for uh, anyone who's new to this game. My dear girl, please always remain who you are. Let nothing stain you, nothing take you away. That is all I ask of you. Mm. Ah. Oops, I slept a little late, huh? All right, change clothes. Yes, heck yes. All righty, looking mighty sharp. There. Guess everyone's outside. All right, basic movement. Yeah, I know. I, I know the the basics. Oh, she's so adorable. Um, empty trash can. One of the books about to see. An assortment of stuff. A decorative anchor. A spare hat in case it gets blown away in the wind. Back with clothes. Back with clothes. Am oh, more magic. Oh, magical candies. See now, I'm gonna try to do a little more exploration in this game because when I originally did this, I skipped over pretty important stuff in terms of items and stuff like that. I might get like a few more of these. Okay, I'm not gonna waste the whole video doing this. Um, okay, so I'm just gonna assume that Fukami, Momoka, and Dolphy, these are their beds, obviously. You, you got, for those who don't know who, who I'm talking about, you'll see them once we get out here. Well, you'll see M Momoka first. Morning, Momoka! Ah! Morning, Wada! Bet you slept well, huh? Gosh, how many times you'd wake me up? Sorry, sorry. You're the one late sleeping wit- wait, yeah. You're, you're one late sleep- ah, damn it, yeah. You're one late sleeping witch. Go see the others. Right, right. Yeah. It's been a while since I've, uh... Okay. Let's see Dolphy first. Oh. Morning, Watanohara. Morning, Dolphy. Uh... What's up? Um, there's... Lots of sharks over there. Sharks are... Scary. Uh... It's okay, Dolphy. They're not scary at all. But really? Yeah, trust me. Okay, I guess I can only go this way. Hey, morning, Watanohara. Morning, Fukami. Had a good sleep, I take it. Yeah, I'm kind of, um, conked out. Tired from the journey. Uh, yeah, no, tired from the long journey. Don't push it. I'm fine. <sighs> Phew, how much farther are we, is it going to be? Hello, my name is Wada Nohara. I'm a witch. Right now, I'm traveling with my familiars to return to my home sea. Alright, better get moving. Yeah, it's been a while, man. A really long time since I've played this game. It's been almost two years. Since um, I, I released the first episode of my old Let's Play of this game. Alright, I'm going to be grinding a lot in this game. So, I may even skip over some of these. 
uh, for you guys' sake. Uh, and then... Uh, attack this one, and then they attack the other one. Alright. <sighs> Alright. Um... Yeah, these things can't attack back, I... I... Presume? Which is great about, like, the first bit of fodder that you encounter in this game. Is that they don't, uh... Necessarily... Got a life preserver. Uh, alright. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna make these episodes as long as 25 minutes because, uh, you know, just like for the sake of the viewers. And, uh, what the hell am I doing? <clears throat> yeah, for the sake of the viewers and for the sake of, you know, just time in general. You know, I've, I've had a habit of making really long videos back in the day, so I'm trying to, you know, do less of that. Oh yeah, I finally figured out what this thing is. So this is a, an Andean, um... Andean uh, uh, cock of the rock. It's a type of bird with like a, a disc-shaped um, crest. It's kind of like a it's, it's like a, a, a large bird, and it basically has like this big ball thing near its beak and like the, its forehead. I'll uh, I'll show a picture in in a second, but yeah, I, I actually did some research, and you know, this is what Mogiko enjoys drawing. Respond. All right, I'll be right back. Hold on a second. All right, here we go. Ah, what's floating there? A letter? Maybe the postman? Indeed. Which means... Perhaps he may have crashed somewhere again. That's not good. Oh, this. Oh, this is just dec. This is just, this is just decor, de decorate, decoration. Which is pretty nice, though. I, I, I always like the. Uh, yeah, Deep Sea Prison has a really you know decorative side to their art, and I guess that, that, that's what attracted me to their art because uh, it's just really um. Another one. Is he on that island? Possibly. Let's see. All right, Star Isle. Not like the name of this place will matter too much, but yeah, Star Isle. That's where that's where we are right now. Oh man, this takes me back. Wait, two letters. <laughs> yeah, it's clever. <clears throat> oh, there goes our postman or our post goal. Which is weird because Momoka is a seagull, but then like. This, you know, this seagull right here looks nothing like her. Or like humans and seagulls interbreeding or something. I, I don't know. Ah! Uh, are you okay? Uh, mm, I'm hungry. Not this again. He's been too busy with work to eat, surely. Ah. Uh, done for. I'm a goner. Wadanohara, do you like roast fowl? N no thanks. Hold up! Wait, is that not a pro Damn it. Ugh. Is that not a pro proclamation of war against me? Yeah, because he's a, a, a seagull. Want fruit stars. Gotta be fruit stars. Huh? Hey, I've got donuts on me, so take them and put up with it. I want fruit... or oh, star fruits. Why? Any food should be fine, right? Am I right? Uh, well, star fruits grow elsewhere on the island, so we can go get some. 
What? Wait, yeah, just leave the lay just leave the layabout. He should get he should get him himself. Birds of a feather are harsh on each other. Star fruits. Um, look, wait, he looks so pained. Let's go fetch some. If that's if that's what you want, fine. Yeah. Not approving. Uh, all right, so we're just gonna go get some um, star fruits. What's over here, real quick? Whew. Yeah, I apologize if my voice acting gets a little like wonky here and there, because again, it's been a while since I've done this. You know, I've been busy with editing and stuff like that. So playing games myself, it, it just hasn't really been clicking with me too well. Even with like my Pokemon Let's Play, it's been kind of hard. Warning: Eating too many star fruits will induce hallucinations. Do not eat more than ten a day. Well, um, they're not good for you, apparently. Here we go, the star fruits. Uh, let's get them back to him quickly. Phew. Eh, what the? Ain't giving you this star fruit, uh huh? These are ours, see? Huh? What's that? They're not anybody's, right? Ain't yours. Why the... These guys need a beating. Huh? Why well, don't Hara. We can have roast... We can have a roast fowl feast. Roast fowl? Is that tasty? Hmm, that's not bad. Hurrah! Smash him! Hold on, everyone! Administer beating? Um... Yeah, let's this, 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 this do it. I don't, even, I don't know why I even slept it, no. Yes, yeah, so let's administer the beating. Alrighty. I'm Fat and yeah, they're, they're they're learning all their skills pretty quickly too. Ah! You're hungry, right, Watanohara? Take this. Got roast fowl. Th thanks, Fukami. Jeez, I am fed up with all these guys. Watanohara, the star fruit. Why are you whining? Oh yeah, right. Let's hurry and bring the star fruit. Alrighty, let's. Okay, we only get one star fruit. All right, makes sense. Makes perfect sense. Yeah, lots of sense. What was over there again? I don't even remember. Are you all right? <clears throat> we got the star fruits. Please eat up. Mm hmm. Oh, well, well, the gang's all here. Long time no see. Ho, ho, ho. Ah, what lifesavers you are. Are you okay, Mr. Nekoyama? Never been better, thanks to you. Ho, ho, ho. Plum forgot to get a bite to eat with all the work I'm doing. Ho, ho. Guess I'll, guess I have a bit of a bird brain after all. Ho, ho. Ah, this guy. My, sorry for the trouble, Miss Water Nohara. It's fine. I'm just glad it didn't get, um, serious. Rose Fowl. Huh? N n n nothing Oh, it was terribly rude of me to stop you on your return trip. I'll have to make some make amends for this sometime. N no, it's fine. Bird meat. Good meat that. Fukami! Well now, I still got loads of work on the pile, so if you'll excuse me. Hope you'll be okay. 
real foul. She's, she's constantly thinking about it. Stupid bird. What are you, at, Uncle Tom, Momoka? We should get going as well. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm gonna, take, I'm gonna take my time to read this nice and carefully. I have a big uh, stuttering problem. In terms of, uh, I, when I get excited or nervous, I tend to do that a lot. So when I'm reading the dialogue, I'll take my time. Well, I'll try my best to take my time. But, um, yeah, we're almost uh, done here with the first episode. Again, I'm not trying to make these too long. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna grant some more. Got another life preserver. <clears throat> What's in here? Probably no point in docking here. Alright, well... Alright, that should be the last of them. Oh, wait, wait, one more. I won't skip this time, given that it's getting to be quite a hassle on my end. Life preserver, yes. Uh, I'll skip these for now. I think I've I think I've gotten enough experience for now. Uh, I just want to move for forward with the plot. The weather's good. We should be able to get back just fine. Thank goodness. Hey, or I don't know who's saying that. Why don't O'Hara? Ah! Hmm. Whoa! Pitch Black Witch! Klomaki! Phew! Finally caught up to you! Gosh, the sea is way too big! I don't know, Hara! I'm here too! Oh, and Lopko! No one cares about Lopko. The sea surface is so dreary. I was getting bored on my broom. Is that right? Klomaki, why are you here? Hmm? <laughs> well, just thought the occasional flight over sea might be nice. Wait, Klomaki, that's not true. You have a delivery, right? Oh, right you are, Lopko. Wadanohara, you forgot something. Huh? Your ocarina? Here, it's your ocarina. Ah! Uh Ah! Very important, am I right? Y yes How could I have forgotten this? Clumsy Wada. Uh. I felt like I was missing something, but... I, I didn't think I'd have forgotten something this important. Eh, it happens. First time going there, wasn't it? Must have been all nerves. It, yes. Did you really come out here just to give me this? Yep. Komaki, thank you so much. No prob, no prob. Wanted to fly around here anyway. I was scared I'd fall out of her hat. Oh, it's fine. It is not! Jeez, what a nagging familiar you are. Maybe you should learn from Wada no Haras, yeah? Um, a bird, an octopus, and... A shark? I am not a shark! Aw, oh, you made Dolph cry! <laughs> sorry, sorry. Lady Klomaki, sharks and dolphins are completely different. Pretty similar if you ask me. They are not! Alright, alright, I'm sorry. I mean, come on now, fish all look the same to me. Lady Klomaki, dolphins aren't fish. <sighs> hmm? What's up, Wadonohara? Oh, uh, it's nothing. Hmm. Klomaki, thank you so much again. It's fine, seriously. Maybe I'll come with you while I'm at it. Uh, I can go home! Well, I've got minor business, so maybe that'll have to wait. <sighs> well, excuse me for now. See you later, Watanohara. Yes. Phew. 
not a shark. Not. Are you traumatized from that? Not that scary. Dolph, not all sharks are like that one. Yeah, that shark is a special case. <sighs> mm. Wada no Hara. <sighs> is that really so important to you, even now? <sighs> of course. <sighs> Not a shark. God damn it, Dolphy. Whew. All right, so we're going to leave off here for episode one of Wada no Hara and the Great Blue Sea. If you guys like what you see so far, be sure to stick around because it's only going to get more interesting from here. Though I must warn you, things get pretty bad in this story, so brace yourself for when that happens. So this has been Keto, and this has been Wada no Hara and the Great Blue Sea. See you in episode two. Peace out.